Uh, the Clinton Foundation investigation is far more expansive than anybody has reported, I think, so far. Yeah, because remember, Comey last July basically wouldn't comment on it, and we, and we kind of believed for a long time that there wasn't much of a Clinton. Right, president. and that was a, basically about Washington's influence in that. The several offices separately were doing their own investigations. Uh, that's one. Two, uh, Remember the immunity deal that supposedly Cheryl Mills and Heather Samuelson, uh, two top aides for Hillary Clinton, got from the Justice Department in which uh, it was believed that the laptops that they had after a narrow review for classification emails were going to be destroyed by the FBI. We have been told that those definitively have not been destroyed. They are at the FBI field office here in Washington and are being exploited. Uh, three. Uh, the Clinton Foundation investigation is so expansive, they have interviewed and re-interviewed many people. Uh, they describe the evidence that they have as, quote, a lot of it, and there is an avalanche coming every day with WikiLeaks and the new emails. They are, quote, actively and aggressively pursuing this case. Remember, the Foundation case is about the pay for play, the allegations right. of Secretary Clinton. Yeah, people made contributions to the Clinton Foundation, and because of that, uh, they were able to to extract uh, attention at least, and not, if not more, from the State Department. If I have that right? Exactly. Um, so they are taking the new information, and some of them are going back to interview people for the third time. Um, we, as opposed to what has been written about the Clinton Foundation um, investigation, it is expansive. Uh, the classified investigation is being run by the National Security uh, Division of the FBI. They are currently, as Catherine Harridge has reported, combing through Anthony Weiner's laptop, uh, and they are having some success, in other words, finding what they believe to be new emails, not duplicates, that have trends. Uh, been transported, if you will, uh, emailed through the server, right. Hillary Clinton's server. Um, lastly, we learned that there is a confidence from these sources that her server had been hacked um, and that it was about a 99% accuracy that it had been hacked by at least five foreign um, intelligence agencies and they believe that uh, things had been taken from that. Now, it sounds to me, Brett, as if what we have here is a much bigger investigation than we thought. What about the role of the Department of Justice in terms of, we know that the Department of Justice resisted some things the FBI wanted in the email investigation. How about the Department's role in this this aspect of the investigation, that involving the foundation? Yeah, this source and uh, two sources say it has not uh, been easy. They have not, uh, it has not been a smooth process. Uh, they believe that they are moving forward effectively now, but uh, there has been some angst about uh, Attorney General Loretta Lynch and what she has done or not done. She obviously did not impanel uh, or go to a, um, right. a grand jury, grand jury from right. at the beginning. Uh, they also have a problem, these sources do, with uh, what President Obama said today and back in October of 2015. Yeah, we're going to get to that later on and that he downplayed it and today he said something that suggests that he's changed his tune a bit about, uh, about Director Comey. Yeah. This does not sound like something that's going to be completed anytime soon, which suggests that if Hillary Clinton is elected, she will take office with not one but two serious investigations of her past conduct hanging over her. Definitely. And I pressed again and again on this very issue. And these sources said, yes, the investigations will continue. There's a lot of evidence. And barring some obstruction in some way, they believe they'll continue to uh, likely a, an indictment. Wow. Wow. Brett Baer, thanks, buddy. Thanks for coming across the whole at the end of your show and helping us out sure. here.